Hey y'all, what is up and welcome back to the channel or welcome if you're new here. So in today's video, I am filming a what's in my purse. Don't mind the glare. I don't really have much options for filming space. I'd film in my room, but it is currently 8.48 at night and my child is already asleep. Normally he's asleep at nine, but he seemed extra sleepy today. I should say so I put him out early so let's just get on with the video so this is my bag it is a dupe to like the Palm Springs mini I think this is actually a little bigger than the Palm Springs mini but whatever I'm just going to show you everything that I carry in my bag so first thing is my keys and I got this little key ring off Amazon this airpods case off Amazon this chapstick holder off Amazon, and this I just got at work. So yeah, I just have my work key, my parents' house key, my house key, my car key, and my tile. This right here is a lifesaver. Today I got off work, and I normally have my keys hanging on this little hook by my desk. Could not find my keys so I set off my tile and I found my keys it confused one of my co-workers because she wasn't here when I like lost my keys and got the tile after the fact so she was a little confused but anyways next thing is phone obviously I am filming on my phone right now but I have this just in case this obviously doesn't work but I have like like learning activities on here for Levi and stuff for just if he's been like really really super good as like a reward I don't try to just have him stare at a screen all the time like he rarely gets screen time but if he's been like super good and super patient then I'll let him play he has a piano game that he really really loves so I let him play that sometimes next I have but wipes you just never know when you're going to need to wipe something down and these are just from up and up and i really like them so i'll probably repurchase those and then i just have my my wallet it's just a steve madden wallet because i had a wallet that like matched this but the little like snap part you know this little part that like snaps open and closed it like popped off and it's like two small pieces and I was able to put them back on but I was just afraid to use it because I didn't want it to snap off around my kid and he's just a little over a year old so I didn't want him choking on it so I just this wallet was in at work I've been eyeing it for a while so I just broke down and bought it it was ten dollars so it's just got this change spot right here it's got this slot these card slots right here which is all like my gift cards and then the middle is all my like important like everyday cards that I use and then here is like insurance cards and then if I have any cash it goes here I never carry cash so there's that um next I have hand sanitizer not one but two one of these I just need to take into work which is this one that way I can like spray and like sanitize my desk you know so this is like gone this is just the everyone for everybody hand sanitizer spray it's lavender and aloe so and then I just have the honest company one this is just um lavender field and it's made without synthetic fragrances parabens triclosan and benzalconium chloride I'm pretty sure I said that wrong but you get the point. So next I have my deodorant. If I don't carry deodorant in my purse, I won't remember to put it on. So I just have, this is just Love, Beauty and Planet. The coconut oil and yang yang lang lang. I can't, I can't pronounce it. Y-L-A-N-G and then that again. So comment down below how you pronounce that because I really want to know. So this is a deodorant with plant-based deodorizers, so it's all natural. 
I've been trying to use more all natural products with like my house cleaning products and all that stuff. So yes. Um, next is a big bottle of ibuprofen because you never know when you're just gonna have a migraine that just won't go away. Or if like somebody's like, hey, do you have any like ibuprofen or something? You can be like, yes, well, yes I do. And you can pull out this big bottle, which is kind of funny, but I always carry this. Cause I have a lot of muscle pains like 24 seven, but it's okay. And then I have a wall block, but I don't have a cord. So like, it's kind of pointless. So I just have my wall block. Um, and next, I have an old medicine that I don't take anymore. That I was taking, but now I'm not. So I need to take it to Walgreens because they like safely like dispose of it. Like medicines and stuff like that. And then I have my new medicine that I'm taking for my anti for for my depression, for my anxiety, and all that stuff. So bupropion. It's the equivalent to Wellbutrin. So just if you're curious. And then I have this. Which this just has um, um, allergy medicine in it, so I don't have to carry a big bottle of that around. It also has ibuprofen in it, but I'm going to stick the ibuprofen in the darn ibuprofen bottle. And next, I have my sunglasses. I keep my glasses in my car, in my like glove compartment, not my glove compartment, I have like a sunglasses like the holder thing where I just press it and it pops open and I can like say this out my glasses or whatever in there. So I just have these sunglasses. I'm not sure the brand, but I love them and they have 100% UV protection. Um, I can tell you that they were made in China and that's about all I know. They are like a tortoise shell print, so they're super, super cute. And then I just have the last thing on the inside is my mask, and this is just bees. Always carry a mask in my bag. That way, if I'm going to a grocery store or any store, I can be safe and have my mask. Even though it's not required where I am, I still like to wear it just as a safety measure, as a precaution. So then there's two little like side little pockets. So in one of the side pockets, I have my e.l.f. Calm Bomb. So I'm gonna put some of that on, actually. I don't know that I like it, but I obviously bought it and I've already used it, so I'm not gonna return it. And then on this side, I just, what do I, what do I even have? Oh, I have some earrings and my jewel and no i do not smoke around my kid nor will i ever that just it just obsessed me and i don't really i don't really use that but i honestly could probably sell it i probably should because i don't need it and it's not, i know it's not good for me so and then in this front part here is a plethora of tampons. If you're curious, I use the U by Kotex, just a click compact, and this is just regular. Because that's what I use. So yeah. I actually got this per <clears throat> this purse off of Wish. It was fifty-four dollars plus tax. But I actually ended up getting it for free because when it came, it's supposed to have like two zippers, one on this side and one on this side, you know, like most backpacks do. But I went to use the zipper on this side and it just came right off. So I got a hold of customer, a customer service representative and I got the $64 I spent on this back into my account. 
so I got it for free and it's still like a really nice bag it just doesn't have a zipper like two zippers which it's kind of a pain just to have to like like if you only have one hand it's like if I'm holding the other or whatever and I need to like get in and like close it sometimes it is a pain but it was free and I did actually purchase a Steve Madden crossbody off of Poshmark for $10 plus shipping so it was $17.11 um it's the dome style crossbody the flat bottom and then it's rounded and it is black so it'll match my wallet but yeah so that is everything I keep in my little bag. I really don't carry a whole lot of extra nonsense. You don't see the point. Oh, I don't know that I talked about this, but one day I was wearing this Kylie Jenner like lip stick thing. <laughs> it's um, bare velvet or maybe it's a I don't know bare velvet I was wearing it one day and I actually like you know put makeup on which it's rare which I did actually put makeup on today when I got to work because I had time and I packed it because I wanted to wear stuff but then about halfway through the day I get actually I get back from a chiropractor appointment and I had to go to the bathroom so like I go downstairs and I always check this the shoe section to make sure there's not sandals in it because without a doubt there's always a pair of sandals and there was but I was walking and one of the shoe shelves stuck out farther than the other ones which it's never been like that but like we built it and we made sure it wasn't like that so nobody would get hurt and I ran my shoulder and you can't see it but I have a bandage on because I got sliced it's still kind of tender when it bumps like it was hurting I had to put a bandage on because when my shirt would like rub or my bra strap would fall on it and rub it it was painful but I ran right into it and I was like, oh, and I come upstairs. I didn't, I, like, I went to the bathroom, but I couldn't even, like, I didn't even have to go to the bathroom anymore. I was, like, in some pain. I'm walking up the stairs, and one of my coworkers is like, are you okay? And I'm like, mm -mm. And, I, and I'm attempting to talk to my mom, and she's like, what? I, I don't, I'm like, just, okay. that's why I'm talking to you. She's like, let's just go downstairs and look. And I was like, yeah, I, like, ran right into it. She was talking to somebody about it. She's like, oh, you must just. And stood up and like bumped. I was like, no, I ran right into it. 10 out of 10, wouldn't recommend. But okay, motorcycle. Thank you for that. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. Hit that subscribe button and comment down below a video video you would like to see. I'll probably do a what's, uh, an updated what's in my purse when I get the Steve Madden. Oh, something I'm going to add. I also sometimes throw in a diaper or two. And then this is like a diaper bag and a purse all in one. Because I don't carry a diaper bag. I don't see the point of that extra weight. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoy. And I'll see you in the next video. Whenever that is. Bye.